Hi, I'm Jonathan McDonald from Province Sports. This has been a mentally taxing couple of days for columnist Tony Gallagher as I've asked him A, to play Canucks head coach Gallagher and B, to play Canucks general manager Gallagher. Um, and Tony, you've made uh, a few friends, maybe a lot of enemies uh, doing those two things. Today I'm going to ask you to put yourself in the shoes of longtime uh, passionate Canucks fans, uh, some of whom, of course, who've been fans of this club for nearly 45 years and have not seen a Stanley Cup come to the uh, West Coast. So now you're in their shoes. Um, what are you supposed to be thinking right now? Are you, are you supposed to be feeling optimistic about the way this club go is going or pessimistic? Well, I think I'd feel um, a little bit down about this uh, commitment to making the playoffs, for sure. Uh, I just like to see them play wide open, uh, entertaining as a fan, and not necessarily worry so much about making the playoffs because it's just going to cost me X number of dollars more. They're entirely likely to be exterminated in the first round, and uh, it leaves a very, you know, well, at least we made the playoffs taste in your mouth, but uh, it doesn't help your draft pick. And really, um, what this city yearns for is not a, a first round playoff exit, it yearns for a Stanley Cup. So that's what I would be trying to get them to do. They got Jim Benning because he was a great scout, because he had great background with younger players, finding younger players. Let's let him do that. Uh, that would be my thought. And um, obviously, uh, I'd like to see Bo Horvat get a more prominent role. Um, there's there's other other things that I've mentioned, but mostly as a fan, I, I just like to see the emphasis changed a little bit and to see younger players get a better opportunity. I'd like to see Nicholas Jensen get an opportunity, Zach Cassian, while he's still young, so they can find out what they've got. Uh, you know, I'm just tired of looking at 34-year-olds, to be honest with you. I mean, they're great players. Don't get me wrong. I don't want to mean mouth them in any way. But really, it's time for some new blood to be at least introduced into this lineup and into the thought process of these people. Well, it sounds like there's reason both for pessimism and optimism. Thank you, Tony Gallagher. And of course, Monday, join us when I chat with Jason Botchford, who will be in Florida for another Canucks versus Luongo game.